Hello everyone and welcome to Instant Biology by Dr. Nilab. I am I am here with you with another very important information related to pursuing careers in abroad. So today I am going to discuss about the opportunity that has been advertised by Kyoto University and uh, there is a program that they have announced and uh, the name of the program is Amgen Scholars Program. So first thing is that you can get uh, this uh, uh, this website detail in the description section and uh, you can click on the link that uh, we would give and then you can uh, directly come on to this page now in this particular video i would be telling you how you can avail this fellowship how many students would get selected uh, which country uh, students from which countries are eligible apart from that what uh, what are the things that you would be getting or what facilities you can avail uh, students from which discipline can participate in this program this also we would be going through so uh, uh, to be in brief you would also be getting scholarship over here you would be getting uh, facilities for accommodation uh, this is included in this particular uh, uh, program apart from that you would also uh, get the travel uh, reimbursement in this particular program so let us uh, quickly go through the important details so uh, Kyoto University basically this program is announced by Kyoto University these are the deadlines so key dates uh, application opens on November 1st 2025 3 p.m. and uh, online application would be closing on February 1st 2026 notification of the results would be on late March 2026 and program period would be June 5th to August 6th 2026 now uh, in this particular uh, uh, section we would be discussing about the program overview 10 students would be selected the period of the program as I have already said June 5th to August 6th and uh, then we can discuss about the different areas uh, from which students would be selected biochem bioengineering bioinformatics chemi informatics biopsychology biotech chemical and biomolecular engineering chemistry immunology and medical pharmacology microbiology molecular cell developmental biology so these are the areas so if you are studying any of these areas or you have a degree in these areas then you can apply to this so placements would be made based on students interest and available spaces now we while each amgen scholar will be assigned for supervision by a specific kyoto university faculty member that means you would be working under a, a faculty member from this uh, kyoto university uh, supervision and guidance also may be provided by other persons associated with the supervising professor's lab so this is clear i mean you can get guidance from any individual who is working uh, in the professor's lab so all placements are full time approximately 40 hours per week you'll have to spend in the university now educational activities apart from the full time research position that you would be availing you can also be a part of the other activities that are taking place in the universities for example seminars and lab visits poster sessions so on and so forth so this is a, a, a amgen scholars asia symposium uh, in this uh, you can also take part so it is obligatory uh, to take part in this uh, symposium so this would be taking place either in tokyo during the uh, this would be taking place uh, uh, in tokyo maybe and uh, you have to take part in this particular uh, symposium now talking about the financial supports so kyoto university stipulates the travel schedule and route and provides an economy class airline ticket that means your traveling would be reimbursed for students from universities outside japan airline tickets are provided for flights between the nearest airports to the students university and osaka next for students from universities in japan excluding kyoto university students a round trip ticket provided for travel between the nearest airport to students university in osaka so both of these have been given that means if you are uh, outside japan if you are in japan so both of the uh, travel would be reimbursed talking about accommodation all amgen scholars will be uh, getting accommodation in kyoto talking about scholarship uh, 180000 that means 180000 yen will be provided to amgen scholars that means 90000 yen in two parts at the start and the mid program now note all the students must arrange their own private health insurance so this is important uh, living in abroad uh, you have to uh, take care of the insurance please be aware neither the amgen foundation nor kyoto university can provide health insurance so you can check that out 
uh, over here eligibility and requirements have been mentioned so general eligibility has been mentioned over here uh, mostly i would want to uh, emphasize on these particular points applicants must have so this if you if you are a uh, non native english speaker that means if you uh, english is not your first language then you can have these uh, scores but if you can produce a certificate that uh, in the last 5 consecutive years uh, you have been taught a program or you have studied an english taught program for the last 5 consecutive years or more you do not need to submit the english proficiency certificate right also you should be interested in doing a phd you should have a strong academic record so these these are the things that you should have at least apart from that uh, Uh, the people or the students from these countries are eligible eastern asia southeastern asia central asia and the names of the countries have also been mentioned over here india if you are from india uh, so this falls in the southern asia category now over here you can check out the list of the host uh, laboratories you can check on the laboratory information over here application deadline already i told you it is uh, mentioned over here and uh, you can just click on this and you would get a detailed uh, uh, notification on how you can apply so this is the online application uh, portal basically the full application guidelines you can click over here and you can check out the full application guideline now one more important thing before we move uh, further so there is a program that we had started udan program in this udan program uh i supervise students who are applying to different phd programs in india or different masters programs in india if you have any questions you can attend the general or you can take part in the general consultation session if you are uh, applying to abroad for example if you want to apply to such internships abroad and uh, if you want to apply for masters or phd programs abroad then we have different uh, uh different uh, services for you that you can avail so for example general consultation services uh, if you want to apply for india or phd india indian programs or uh, abroad programs then you can take general con consultation session in which i can advise you that uh, how you can go about it apart from that if you have other queries related to your career you can always come up and uh, you can take part in this general consultation session apart from that document preparation now uh, students face Uh, difficulties in sop preparation letter of motivation preparation their cv preparation so all these things can also be taken care of document preparation is an important service that we provide interview preparation now when you get a call for interview from any abroad university or from indian university obviously you can connect with us we can organize mock interviews for you and then uh, you can avail the uh, the service that we provide so how to how how does it work so Uh, just to give you an idea about how affordable this program is if i tell you about the general consultation session so general consultation uh, session so it requires only rupees 299 and uh, you would get a time of 45 minutes and during this time you can uh, ask your queries to us apart from that uh, different services for example document preparation interview preparation they require uh, they have different fees associated if you want to contact to us this uh, this is the number through which you can connect with us 8299134528 or if you want to email us you can email us on samadhanlifesciences@gmail.com so uh, you can book a consultation with us you can connect with different experts we have uh, experts from different areas from europe from us and uh, uh, from india as well from different uh, organizations from different labs apart from that uh, from australia as well so there are different uh, apart from that in japan as well we have uh, people working in japan who can guide you that how you can make a good uh, uh, application so that is all so uh, coming back to what we were discussing so just a minute yeah so this is the application procedure i would recommend that you write a good application procedure uh, study the application procedure and write a good application so create your account next fill out the required details now complete the online application form and immediately after you submit application an email notification you would receive apart from that you would also uh, you would also have to submit the recommendation letters so uh, make sure that your recommendation letters are uh, sent and uh, rest everything is uh, just regular so yeah 
so if you have any questions further you can always mail to uh, this particular email and you would be getting further details so i believe uh, uh, this video was useful for you so if you like this video just hit the like button and do not forget to subscribe our channel thank you so much and have a good day